Hi you guys, it is Trinity. If you're new, welcome. If not, welcome back. So today, y'all are going to... <laughs> so for today, as y'all can see by the title, y'all are gonna get ready with me to run a couple errands today. I really have a lot to do today business-wise though, but I'm also thinking about doing a little shopping today. Not nothing too heavy, just getting some important essentials that I'm kind of running out in, like household essentials and stuff. Um, and yeah, but before we get into the video, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click that bell icon so you can notify every time I upload a new video. It's 10 30 in the morning right now, and I made sure to go ahead and fix Ava some food so she won't be like whining and all this other type of stuff that she be doing. I think she's all good, she really didn't even eat all of her food. I usually always give her, since she's so small, like half of like can most times she won't even eat all of it at once she'll eat half of the half i give her and later on the other half it just really depends on the day and she's over there messing with something now but anyway i really don't have an idea of what i want to do to my hair um like i told y'all before i think i have i think i have told y'all i think i didn't i really don't know it doesn't matter but i plan on like embracing my natural hair more um this is gonna be the most y'all gonna see my hair on youtube i think if i'm not mistaken i showed my hair like one other time and that was like years ago i just feel like i have so much more to learn about my hair and i really want to be able to embrace my hair more and it's not the fact that i'm ashamed of my hair reason being of why i always wear protective styles but Sometimes I just didn't know how to like properly manage it or didn't know what type of hairstyles to do but that was because I wasn't trying to learn if I'm just being honest with myself. It's like I was, like I would do the research but I didn't like put it into action. I would just take my hair down, go ahead and wash it and dry it next day put another protective style in one thing i do know for sure i have bad shrinkage it was looking longer than this yesterday but i think the fact i slept on it last night well i didn't really sleep on it. i had a bonnet on but it kind of like you know all bowed up at the end and stuff but i think i'm gonna go ahead and just do the same style just a little low ponytail because i really like how that looks I'm do a little soft glam look since i'm gonna be out all day probably and yeah i don't mind getting like feedback or advice so if you do have type 4 hair and you see something that i don't know or if you think that our hair is like similar or whatever just let me know down in the comments like remedies or stuff that you do to make your hair more healthy and to make it grow more yeah i'm just figuring it all out but anyway just so I won't like keep blabbing so much. I'm just finna. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. I'm actually doing my hair on camera. What are you doing? Is she. What are you doing? Like. <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't know if y'all really care, but nothing is really wrong with my finger. I just have a band aid on it. Well. Y'all know those little skins that be like um, peeling? Not peeling, but it be 
hanging off your finger, the ones that hurt really, really bad, like anytime you touch it, it hurts. That's the predicament I'm in. That's why I just went ahead and just put a Band-Aid on it because I kept touching it. I kept bumping my finger against any little thing and it just always hurt. And I'm really scared to rip it off because I feel like if you're able to rip that little piece of skin off and have no reaction, it's, it's something wrong. It's something wrong for real. Because there's no way that little skin is painful. Another thing about my hair, I don't think it's as thick. I don't think it's as thick, I think I said that right, as it used to be when I was a little girl. Um, I don't know, this may be triggering some of y'all. I don't know if I'm doing anything right, but I do have a wide tooth comb. I really like to part my hair into sections so I won't be as rough on it. And yeah. Like I said, y'all, I'm just trying to learn more about my hair, so I'm not a hair person to come to. So, yeah. else that I wasn't prioritizing as much when I was I guess calling myself trying to take care of my hair was actually taking care of my hair I would always think that if I would grease my scalp then my hair would grow or like that's the definition of me moisturizing and taking care of my hair but no I was wrong this entire time you actually have to not only apply products on your scalp, but you actually have to place them on your hair. Some people will probably be like, that's common sense to do. But for me, I just felt like, okay, our hair grows from our scalp. So if we just take care of our scalp mostly, then, you know. But this is my hair as of May 16th. This is it. Hold on. It actually feels good, but this is where I am today. Okay. Let me. Now it's time for me to put these ponytails. Well, I'm just gonna put one ponytail in. What did I do with all my... I want to know how everyone's day is going. I wish I had a brush. <laughs> That's one thing, the main thing I am missing, which is unfortunate. Okay. Oh, Lord. It took me all those steps just to do this. Like, 
Oh, this is so pretty. So that's the end for my hair. I really don't need no makeup, but I just want to put a little concealer on my face. If y'all see my last video, y'all will know that this is my natural soft glam look. Pretty quick, pretty simple. It's 11.17. I don't know what time I start this video. I know it was 10 something. I forgot just that quick. Once I go back and edit, I'm going to see how long this all really took me. Because I feel like I'm taking a very long time. You can say yes, And that is literally it. Y'all saw that I was using the napkin a couple times to dab on my face. Cause to me, it looked like I had on too much concealer, even though I literally just only put a dot on each side. Like I said, I just like to look as natural as possible, which kind of defeats the purpose of me like putting concealer on in the first place. I just feel like putting concealer under my eyes kind of makes I don't know. It adds this extra glow, I guess, to it. I hope the ponytail looks really cute from the side. I mean, but I really enjoyed recording this video. Like I said, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the bell icon and so you notify every time I upload a new video. I'm about to go ahead and just pick out some clothes and head on out. I feel like my edges look pretty too. I mean, even though I'm looking at myself in the camera, I really can't see that much. <laughs> But I can see it right here, like in my mirror. So it's pretty. Oh, my camera's about to die. Like I said, like, comment, subscribe. Everyone have a blessed day. Love you all. Stay safe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.